work out the value of x. Now x is this side length here that is opposite to this 42 degree angle. Now I cannot use Pythagoras' theorem for this question because I only know one of the side lengths. In order to use Pythagoras, you have to know two of the side lengths and just be missing one of them. So for this question, I'm going to use right angle trigonometry or Sokotoa. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is label the sides on my right angle triangle. Now, X, this side that I'm trying to find, is opposite to the 42 degree angle. And so I'm going to label that as the opposite. And my 11 centimetre side here is the adjacent. It's next to the 42 degree angle and it is not opposite to the right angle. This side here, opposite to the right angle, is known as the hypotenuse. But we haven't been given in any information about that one, so I'm just going to ignore that one for now. Now, because I've got my opposite and my adjacent, I'm going to use the tan part of Sokotoa. So tan of my angle, which is 42 degrees, is equal to the opposite, which is x, over the adjacent, which is 11. Now, I'm trying to figure out x here, so I'm going to multiply both sides by 11 to get x on its own. So 11 multiplied by tan 42 degrees is equal to x. And now I just need to put this into my calculator. So 11 multiplied by tan 42, close my bracket, is equal to 9.9 .9 centimetres to one decimal place. 